Welcome back to Morgul, my friends. Let me turn off this fan so we don't get buffeting sounds in the thing. Okay. Um, I haven't played in several days. I've been uh, too busy working on caverns, working at work, and working on other things to uh, to get any playtime in. But I have a half hour right now. That may be the only gaming time I have today. Let's give it a shot. Let me uh, make sure I have the right window open and ready. I have, therefore, no recollection of what I was doing. Like, I don't remember if there was a specific... I don't know if we're in the dungeon, if we're upstairs, what the hell's going on. Apparently we're slightly injured, so we're probably in the dungeon. Nope, we're not. Okay, are we here to sell anything? Let's see here. We have five rations of food, five flasks of oil. Maybe we bought stuff recently, is that what we did? We're still carrying this dagger. Are we using the dagger? We don't need the dagger, do we? Is there a reason we're still carrying this stiletto dagger? Have we not tested the main ghost yet? Is that the... Ah, fuck. Let's read a word of recall. I think that's what we were doing. I hope that's what we were doing. And we'll, uh... Hope that that's good enough. Let me move my mouse and cetera out of the way here. One second. Everything's set up for the, uh... I'm working on caverns literally right now. It's just compiling, so I'm like, I got some time. Let's do this now. What are you... I used to not seek out these guys to kill. That's just, that's just dastardly of me. Like, what are you? Oh, you're a leper. Let me kill you. But they could drop money, you know? <laughs> From a gameplay perspective, it makes sense to do so. At least in this game. In some games, it does not. Let us wield a sh shitty torch like Jay. All right, let's start walking around. Drop L. We don't want that. What are we on here? 250 feet. We're in dungeon level 5. We are character level 10. We could easily take the next stairs down, which we will do. Dungeon level 6. Again, I have no idea if we're going to meet the fucking Nazgul any time now. We'd be getting towards the time when we would, if they are evenly spaced. I don't know if that's... I have no way of knowing if that's how it works. A giant blue centipede. We haven't killed any of these before. Let's kill it now. We miss, we hit. It misses us. We hit, we hit. Oh, we killed it. What do we got? Empty bottle. Don't need that. As far as I know, they serve no purpose. Oh, we got something here. A copper wand. All right, take that. Lots of things in here. Let's kill the white mushroom patch, okay. Kill that eye right away. It's dead. 46 gold. A toll. A scroll, rather. A toll. Got two of those. What is this? A javelin, which we don't need. I am a little concerned that the uh, it's possible that the jellies are completely ineffectual. We've seen mushroom patches do their thing. I saw the black mushroom patch release really spores of some... What is this? Oh, it's an open door. A bit weird. That's a bit... That's unique to Morgul, at least in my experience. I've never seen doors just, like, at the edges of rooms. Yeah, the mold is attacking us back for sure. So it's not a question that all all stationary monsters are, are ineffectual. I don't even know if that's true. It's just... I don't think we've ever seen a jelly attack us. And I wonder if that's a... You know, a, a problem inherent in Morgul. Which would suck. That would... Means after this game played through, I'd probably never play it again because it would have like a... It would feel to me like it was an incomplete uh, game. Like, that's not... These guys can, I think, maybe drain my strength. I'm not sure. Maybe they set me on fire. I'm not sure. Um, it would feel like it was a mistake, you know, that was never rectified. But I just don't know if that's true. This is a jackal, not a problem. All right, good. We can use more of those. Let's just finish flushing this out. I'm hungry, man. Holy Christ. It's been an eventful morning here. We got uh, 
I got notice from one of, from one of my employers, the uh, the day job employer, that there was a stabbing in the alley we all used to access work last night. Not uncommon in uh, in the downtown core of Toronto. Give me half a second while I figure out what I'm doing here. Oh yeah, wield the uh, pick. Um. All right, wield the main gauche. Um, but while I was embroiled in a debate with them about you know what needs to be done, um, there was thereafter a, a, a vi while I was in, involved in that debate online, there was a violent attack behind my house as I watched out the window. There was somebody getting the shit kicked out of them uh, back there, so I had to call the police about that. I'm dealing with two different crises at once, but uh, police arrived. By the time they got here, the uh, fight had ended, and I don't know where the victims etc had gone. So I don't know what the hell happened with that. And as far as work, I understand they actually are looking into getting a, a full-time security guard stationed in the alley we have to access, which is a good thing because it's uh, always populated by rather dangerous persons. All right, this is not necessarily looking promising. Hungry, yeah, so am I. Eh? All right. Hmm. <clears throat> Oops. We are only character level 10, but so far that uh, ability for the warriors to sever, you know, body parts from other monsters has not uh, played any significant effect in the game that I have seen. Um, I'm hoping that changes. Because, shoot. Because I really don't like uh, playing Warriors. I was just thinking about that as I walked through the darkened room again and thought, gee, wouldn't it be nice to light up this room? Purple speckled Bojan, nice. Let's bash this. Whoops. Let's not use B for books. Let's bash this. B, I guess, would be browse a book. As opposed to shift B, which is bash. A yeek! Let's make sure the num lock is on. I don't know if it is. There now it is. Blue yeek. Light is growing faint. These are obviously malevolent coins of some sort. I do like the idea of the creeping copper coins. It's pretty cool. Something I may someday steal for caverns. We'll see. Probably not, but maybe. Oh, Christ in a handbag. I'm hungry. Um, let's go over here. Drop. No, let's wield our other wooden torch. Let's drop our old, crappy, useless wooden torch. And let us continue. Nothing there that I can see. Oh, wait, there is. <laughs> Black Eek. Money. Well, let's find out, guys. What are we dealing with here? Whoops. Silver Jelly. It should be able to drain my light. Let's just take a look. We got 3725 turns of light in here right now. I'm just going to attack it repeatedly. Oh, yeah, it got me. Okay, that's fair enough. It just doesn't attack very often, it looks like. All right, well, it's get me every third turn or so. I hope that was worth a good amount of experience. Scroll of Summon Monster. I'm not really afraid of this. That could be foolhardy, but I'm going to read it. A Scroll of Summon Monster. 
What do we got? A giant green fly. We know nothing about it, right? Well, let's try killing it. I miss a hit. It misses me. Oops. It's fast, eh? All right, wasn't so bad. Barely did any damage to us. We got more experience. Not going down yet. Not till we get another character level under our belt. Hard leather armor. Let's take a look at that in our inventory. Hard leather armor. It's just, as far as I can see, just six, or does it do minus one to our... What are we wearing? Soft studded leather, five, zero. Hmm, let's try wielding it for now. Just to see what it's like. It doesn't seem to be damned. It doesn't say anything about it constricting us or anything. There are definitely some things I learned in my Moria playthrough, like what the different Nagas do, that I've largely forgotten. Um, or even what these guys do. They might either set me on fire, or they might... Uh, Drain my strength. So it's kind of funny to have invested all that time and I've gained not as much from it as one might wish because I've forgotten so much. I don't know if I can kill these guys in time to make a difference. So watch my experience tour. Five, five, seven. Five, five, eight. Now they're worth less than one. This might just be a, a waste of time battle. I, I would like to clear out the room and continue exploring, but uh, it might be best to just run to a door. Given I can't see where where they are or how many are out here, you know? Maintain um, going down is not the wisest plan right now. So stick to our uh, battle plan as long as we can. How are we doing for that? Uh, we only need 36 more experience to advance to the next level. On the other hand, where are we going? No. What the hell? What is it? What's the uh, command for? Looking around. Um, la la la. Rest tunnel view. I thought it was W for where, but no, locate with map. L. Shift L. Okay, so if we go west, we got places to explore that don't involve lice necessarily. Things not involving lice are among my favorite things in life. Hard leather boots. We already have that. Oops. E. Wearing soft leather boots. Let's try these ones on. A little better, theoretically. K. Alright. Our armor class is a little higher. Alright, we'll take those and sell them. Money. Actually, really relieved that that silver jelly attacked. So I was getting pretty, uh, pretty concerned about that factor. If 
Fuck, I'm not paying attention. I'm watching the text and not watching where uh, where I need to to get the job done here. A saber, one to seven damage. A little bit more to explore. If I if I run out of places to explore that don't, and I'm forced to go back to the lice area, maybe I'll uh, I'll just move on. All right, screw it. Let's go down. We're not that far off the mark. Sixteen more experience will have it. When we finally do teleport back up, which is probably not that far in the distant future, at least we'll uh, be better equipped for it. Yeah. What are we on? Dungeon level seven. Out of 75, let's not forget, not 50 anymore. 75. <clears throat> I think I've seen it all. I think I've seen it all, baby. What we got? Oops. Large green snake, large green snake. Kill at least one of them, moves a bit erratically, is worth four experience points for a 10th level character, nothing's known about his attack. A little bit hard to hit. Not terribly so. I'm gonna take a look at my uh, inventory in a second. If it if we are getting minus one to hit for this hard leather armor, I don't think it's worth it for the uh, one armor class personally. Only oh, have hard studded leather armor. Let's take a look at that too. Even better would be seven armor class. Do we know anything about the? Uh, like it's not telling us about the hard leather armor yet. We don't know if there's a minus associated or not. Let's just leave it on for now. Disenchanter Eye, uh oh. Welcome to level 11. <clears throat> I know that they can, uh, well, they can disenchant, as the name would imply. More hard leather armor. We can sell this stuff at the very least. When our inventory is filled up, we'll just teleport back up. It's going to be a function of this game, like Moria. You got to, uh, you got to return to the surface to sell your stuff. God sakes, I'm doing the wrong thing. Holy Christ! In a handbag. The door holds firm. All right, there we go. <clears throat> Whoops. Well, that was fruitful. <laughs> Great expenditure of our time. Let's try it again. I do like the fact that it differentiates between locked doors and stuck doors. In caverns, we do that with the difference between a locked door and a barricaded door. Found a secret door. Oh, a couple of them. I just want to see if there's something else. Is a secret door? Yep. Secret door is back to back. <laughs> oh, it's creeping silver coins. That's new. We were dealing with copper coins before. They can poison us like all the coins can, as far as I know. While poisoned, our health will continue to drop, but it will stop dropping when we stop being poisoned, and that's just a matter of time. Or using a potion. Let's rest. Indefinitely. Orc. Alright, not a kobold this time. Let's bring it back into the big room in case it, uh... In case it can drop stuff... You know, like that. 37 worth of copper. Just in case you want to make sure it has room to drop it. Silver mouse. They can drain our light. Unless we kill them. Money. 
A metal cap. We can't have room for it. Can't have room. We don't need a potion of water. What, what can we drop? Or use. Um, let's use one of our potions. No, let's use one of our... Yeah. Let's use a... Sm should we... Nah, man, let's drop P. We're not going to use our dagger anymore. Let's grab this, and let's read a word of recall. F. The air about you becomes charged. Yes, it does. There we go. Okay. Let's run around and start selling stuff. Sell to him. A purple speckled potion. We should be able to get nine for it, is that right? Nine. Potion of neutralized poison. We'll recognize those from now on. How about the smoky potions? What are those? Potion of slow poison. Okay. Neutralized poison and slow poison. <laughs> How about the scroll of Snesky L? I think we get exactly the same. Nine. So let's just try and get nine. Scroll of Sleep Monster, that's not terribly unuseful. I mean, it's it's useful, but nonetheless, I'm not going to carry it right now. So, I mean, come on. I'm trying to sell this Potion of Sleep Monster. Uh, he's selling them for 102, so I'm going to offer him 40. I meant 30. All right. Our terrible charisma is going to keep us from ever getting a good deal here. Final offer 16, that's fine. Potion of Sleep Monster sold for 16, sold for 16 dollars. Let's go elsewhere. Do we have anything that can be sold here that couldn't be sold there? Yep, uh, the copper wand. Let's find out what it does. Uh, what are we getting for these, like 40 or something? I don't remember. He's going to throw me out, because that's just what he does. Final offer 23, okay. A wand of lightning bolts, that would have been nice to keep. You see, it's worth 3,000 gold. We sold it for 23. We are awesome at haggling. We have a Wand of Wonder. Again, with our skill at it, it's probably not worth keeping. It's probably better just to sell it. Let's sell our Wand of Wonder. He's uh, taking one for like 1,500. Let's try uh, 600. 500. 400. Really? 300. Jesus Christ. Minus 10. Minus three. I'm going to stick at 115. Oh, for fuck's sakes. For the sake of two gold pieces. That jerk. Will you buy it? <laughs> no. All right, we're stuck with it for the time being. We have Scrolls of Enchant armor we can buy and shit. Those are all great, but we're nowhere near the armor we want to use. We want to get more, get more gold and buy much better armor. Let's try selling the hard leather armor. We have a bunch of shit. Let's sell the G. What is he selling hard leather armor for? It does have a minus one associated with it, by the way. Let's sell it for 50. Minus three. All right. Let's sell our hard studded leather armor for more than that. For how about... Um, 
I don't see anything he has of it, so let's sell it for, uh, fuck, I don't know. 80. Oh. Maybe we went too high. Or too low. That's an insult. Agreed! Oh, it was fucking plus two. So that was nine point armor. But, like, you want to save up for, like, bar chain mail. That's what we really want. Get the goddamn bar chain mail. And uh, that's probably the best we're going to see in here. It's the best I ever saw in here in Moria. Let's take a look at what else he has. A set of leather gloves of slaying. Those are pretty nice. They would be plus three to hit, plus four to damage. Give us one armor class plus three armor class. I mean, that'd be great. Obviously, we cannot afford it right now. <laughs> not even close. So we're not worried about that right now. What else can we sell here? Let's sell the metal cap. Uh, for... Fuck, he's selling for 88. Let's try for 30. Minus two. Alright, 14. That's fine. It's just a standard leather cap. Let's sell our pair of soft leather boots. We know those are standard. Probably not for much. Uh, for 10, let's say. For 7. For 5. 2. Alright. Um, we could also sell our... Th you know what we're going to do for now is escape. I'm going to wield... I didn't have to do this, I guess, but let's uh, wield the soft leather armor. Let's put this back on. We know the other thing has a minus 1 to hit. Let's just sell the hard leather armor instead. He's selling it for 163. I forget what we just got for it. Um, let's start at 50. Minus 4. Minus 2. Minus 1. Alright. Oh, it was plus 3 fucking hard leather armor. Oh my god. Well, that's bullshit. All right, well, we're back to our other kind anyway. Uh, we're still saving up, I think, for bar chain mail or something something equivalent. That's really what we're doing here is saving up for that kind of shit. Uh, let's see about selling anything in here. Let's try selling our saber. We're not going to use it right now. We know that for a fact. The main gauche is probably about all we can use with our strength right now and still get two hits. I guess we could try it. Want to leave here for a minute? Let's leave here for a minute and see if we can get... Uh... Let's try equipping G. Let's find a poor guy to test on. Now, we're getting one hit. Let's wield our main gauche again. Sell the saber. No examples of what he buys them for, or what he's selling them for. Um, one to seven, man? I don't know. I'm going way out on a limb and saying 250 gold. Probably is an insult. How about 150? 75? 50? 40? Alright. Final offer is 19. That's fine. Sell. A javelin. I don't want that. 10. Sold it for 6. Alright. Uh, sell these rounded pebbles for 20. 15. Let's just take whatever he's offering here. Okay, there you go. Sell these iron shots. For twenty-three. Oh. All right. I think that's all we have to sell here. We're gonna keep our arrows, obviously, for our bow. Stick with the short bow. There's no point in upgrading to a long bow right now. We're barely using the damn thing anyway. I think that's it. We just want to make sure we have enough food and flasks of oil. We've got the flasks. Let's go, um... How do you refuel a lantern? 
Eh, no, no point worrying about it yet. Let's just go buy a tiny bit of food. Purchase a ration of food. Fine. All right, we've done it. We're out of here, guys. Um, I'm going to call it right here. Let's press Control X. We'll stay in the town in case I remember something later on that I should have been doing and I forgot to. There we are, 1971 Bogue. Half Troll Warrior 11 saved. Good enough. Um, that's it for me for now. Uh, I'll be back when I have a chance to play some more. I've got to get back to work on caverns. There's just so much to do. But uh, we're coming along. we got another release coming out in a couple of weeks. So far, I've gotten the Tree Man and the Lizard Man back up and running. These are races I had removed from the game temporarily to uh, work on their perks. I've re added back in... All the races will be back in, in the next uh, the next run. And I've uh, added back in the Dragon Slayer and the Druid. Got all their perks in order. There's still a lot of races to work on, um, so it's going to take months. But uh, it's coming. It's coming, baby. All right, I'll see you later. Goodbye.